Good evening. It is the 9th of April, 2009. So the address reads 9 April 9. Um, September is going to be amusing, I thought of today. I don't put much stock in numerology, but amusing number dates are fun. Like July 7th, 2007 was a fun one. And the way uh, the Olympics were opened in China this year or last year was August 8th, 2008 at 8.08 p.m. which was 08.08.08.08 or something along those lines. Anyways, that was a big off into the middle of nowhere. We uh, just spent this evening helping friends plan their trip. Originally we were supposed to be going on the trip, but uh, money or time off didn't happen in both in this case. So we helped them plan and it was fun seeing them and now we're I'm doing a video and Tanya's running around trying to get everything ready for bed. And we had very high winds today uh, averaging about 40 miles an hour at the airport with gusts above that and uh, so Tanya got off work today early because Mother Nature said no planes were landing she found out today that her reputation is spreading. Around Christmas time, someone was uh, a, a passenger was heading out, and he, he was he said he's going home to England. He said, "What do you want me to bring back?" So she piped up that she'd like some hobnobs and uh, clotted cream. and clotted cream, and uh, just being facetious and, and well, he brought back multiple packages of hobnobs, which is, well, it's a, the packaging says a digestive biscuit, but it is a cookie. Um, standard one just looks like that. This one has dark chocolate on one side and uh, is really good and there's milk chocolate. Anyways, he brought that back and clotted cream is a dish. You can look it up, but it's almost like when it's done the consistency is almost like a whipped butter but the style that Tanya had when she was in England was a very sweet butter so it was a dessert type thing he brought it back and we were amazed and it was very flattering and very fun uh, but today Tanya got to work and her supervisor went oh cookies yeah by the way when you were at uh, off the other day, um, this lady came up and said you wouldn't recognize her name, but um, these are for you. Turns out it's another person, uh, customer, or, or another passenger that flies out on a regular basis uh, to and from England and brought back some hot rubs. And we don't recognize the name. Uh, Tanya's hoping she'll recognize the face when the lady comes through again, but. Uh, it was quite amusing. So we ended up with hobnobs. Um, they're quite good. And, oh, and uh, clotted cream probably will not be able to be sold in the United States anytime soon because uh, one of the first things you have to do is you have to use non-pasteurized milk for the recipe. And it's hard to find that in the United States without going to a dairy and interrupting the flow of their processing. Um, anyways, We'll talk to you later, and good night.